Kansas City, Missouri, shooting at the Super Bowl celebration parade. What was meant to be a day of celebration and joy, marking the Kansas City Chiefs' Super Bowl victory, tragically turned into a scene of chaos and fear due to gun violence. A shooting near Union Station during the parade underscored a grim reality. Public gatherings designed for communal happiness can too easily become the backdrop for senseless acts of violence, leaving a community in mourning and shock. Investigative findings have shown there was no nexus to terrorism or homegrown violent extremism. This appeared to be a dispute between several people that ended in gunfire. During the overnight hours, we learned there are 23 victims of yesterday's shooting. One of our victims, Elizabeth Galvin, 43 years old, died. We are still learning about her, but know that she is beloved by many. To her friends and family. Near the Kansas City Chiefs Super Bowl victory parade, a shooting incident occurred around Union Station. The Kansas City Police Department reported multiple victims and took two armed individuals into custody for further investigation. A significant police presence was deployed and videos circulated online show a chaotic scene with police and military personnel responding. It has been reported that there are 10 shooting victims, including multiple children treated at Children's Mercy Hospital. And sadly, one of the victims has died. At least three people are in custody in connection to the shooting. Before we move on, if you like our channel, please take a moment to like and share. It helps us grow and continue to produce more content. Now back to the show. Gun violence stands as a stark contradiction to the values of safety, unity, and peace that societies strive for. Its occurrence, particularly on days meant for celebration and joy, transforms these occasions into moments of tragedy and loss overshadowing the intended memories with grief. To address this profound issue, it is essential for the country to adopt a multifaceted approach that includes stricter gun control laws, enhanced mental health support, and comprehensive education on violence prevention. Collaborative efforts between government bodies, community organizations, and individuals are crucial in creating an environment where disputes are resolved through dialogue rather than violence. By fostering a culture of empathy, respect, and understanding, we can work towards eradicating the unnecessary anguish caused by gun violence and reclaim the sanctity of our celebrations. Thanks for watching Sinister Acts here on Pure Evil. Like and subscribe and help support us to bring more great content.